This is an example uh, how to get an elevation grid. Um, I assume I have three walks through my garden and I have tracked these uh, walks and now I have uh, the tracks as wires. This is one and the next one and the third one and all these points uh, belong to the skin of my garden and now I want to get a model of the surface of the garden so I make a fusion of all of them and I have uh, in the reconstruction workbench um, uh, elevation grid object and I start this script and want to demonstrate how it works. This is the script. So the first thing what I see is a map of the area. We can compare it with this picture from top. Here are the points, the control points from my tracks. And here is the height of the different positions. This is a matplotlib window. I close it and then uh, now I have some interesting things. The first thing is uh, here is the set of my control points as a point object in FreeCAD. So point sets also can be imported using the point uh, workbench and the interpolation. And in this case, I see all the control points belong to this skin. And now this is the model. Okay. What can I do? The elevation grid object has a dialog and uh, this is a map of the heights. You see here these two corners are very high and here and here we have the blue seas and here too. This is the place which be, uh, lies deeper. And what can I do? First thing what I can do is I can now uh, create other grids. Here the grid count is 25 and I also can say I want a grid only with 5 intervals. Oh, I see I was on the, on the false dialog, this is a, here, I have to change to 5 and now I see the model is not so fine as in the first case and here is the 5 grid model and we can also use a model with 50 grids. Okay, the other thing what I can do, I can see here what is the height of the different areas. And when I change here the min height, all points which are lower than the min height are shown in this light blue. And I also can restrict the max height of the map and I see what is very high. And of course I can run for this an animation. So and the last picture 
I have changed the grid count to 50 and it still uh, needs some seconds to compute this model and now you see here the grid 6 and this is a more detailed object with 2500 uh, control points.